So iOS 18 has an amazing feature to basically enable RCS messaging. Now, you may want to enable it or disable it. Luckily for you, it's a very, very basic process, and I'll go and show you exactly how to go ahead and fix this problem, or basically just enable or disable RCS messaging. You First of all, you have to be on iOS 18 beta 2 or newer. If you're watching this, do not install the betas. Uh, wait until the official version comes out, and then install that one. So when you're ready, what you want to do is you want to make your way over into your iPhone settings application, which is right over here. And then what you want to do is you basically want to scroll down until you see the apps panel that's all the way at the bottom. So click on the apps panel, which is right here. And then what you want to do is you want to basically scroll down until you see messages. So keep scrolling and then you'll see this little messages option, which comes up right here and go ahead and tap on messages. And then you want to scroll down until you see a little option that says RCS messaging. Now you have to have a SIM card or eSIM installed on your phone. As you can see, I do not see it here, but it should look something like this for you. So you'll see a little option right here that says RCS messaging. And all you're going to have to do is tap onto that option. Now, when you do that, you're going to come into this next page. So there could be a little panel, like it may change in the future, like it could be an indicator. But as of right now, this is the process. So then when you go ahead and tap it on, you'll see this particular panel come up right here. So all you want to do is you can basically just toggle RCS messaging on or off, depending on what you want to do. So if you want it on, you can just go ahead and toggle it on, and that's basically one thing you can do. If you want to toggle it off, you can just go and toggle it off, and that will basically disable it. So I don't know why you'd want to disable it. I would probably recommend just keeping it on. It's kind of the easiest way to just kind of go through and message people. But that is one option you have, and that is something I'd recommend probably a majority of you to go ahead and do. So go ahead, try that out. You want to see if you end up, or you know, if you're able to go and kind of do that. It's a very, very basic thing, but that's basically how you do it for the most part. It's a very, very basic process. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that me so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, till then.